Hello and welcome to Tackle Fanatics TV. In this episode we'll be running through some of the best compact big pit reels, their features and how they compare. The reels we're looking at today are some of the most popular and extensive range of compact big pit reels and we've picked from our selection a variety of manufacturers to give you the best overview of what's available from Tackle Fanatics. When choosing a reel certain features should be assessed, size, weight, line capacity and line lay, retrieval, drag system, aesthetics, gearing and many additional features. We'll start by looking at the size and weight of each reel. The size and weight of your reel makes a huge difference to your angling. Getting the right size is essential and it helps you create a balanced setup. The lighter and more compact the reel, the more user friendly it becomes. Our plethora of reels have the capability to cast at long range, but also great for those that fish in the edge with compact rods like shorter Nash scopes and other stalking style sticks. The cast system QDA weighs in at 450 grams. It's the lightest and most compact in the range due to its Zion body, air rotor, compact 25mm stroke spool and other weight slash space saving technologies that all combine to make this reel the most expensive but by far the most featherweight contender when it comes to size and weight. Daiwa's cast is in BR weighs in at 515 grams, 65 grams over the QDA. The cast is in BR boasts the same spec as the cast is in QDA but has a slightly elongated body to house its free spool system. If you like to utilise a VR facility for your fishing, then that extra couple of ounces is well worth the weight. Witchwood's 55FS weighs in at 680 grams. This compact offering from Witchwood feels very solid and comes in at one of the more weighty in our selection. Although don't be swayed by this as it houses a plethora of features and workhorse-like components that give it fantastic durability and functions that far surpass its affordable price tag. Shimano's 5.5 XTD weighs in at 500 grams. One of the largest reels from our selection, but the second lightest. The Altegra 5.5 XTD sports a lightweight yet rugged body materials and internals to help reduce weight. It still comes in heavier than the Castism QDA, but it's less than half price, which is why it's one of Tackle Fanatic's best sellers. The body and general size of the XTD make it larger than some of the others in the selection. So it may make some shorter, lighter rods less well balanced than some of the other more compact models. Fox's FX9 weighs in at 560 grams. The heaviest in our selection, but by no means a lot. Only weighs in at a few ounces more than some of the other more expensive offerings from Daiwa. The FX9 feels very hardy, encased within a graphite body that gives it a reassuring sense of being very solid and balanced. Sonic's Tornos 6000 weighs in at 548 grams. The Tornos is a scaled down version of the hugely popular Tornos 10,000 Big Pit that has been so popular with anglers all over the UK and Europe. This compact model of the range delivers very similar performance to its big brother, but without the bulk and weight that can tip the balance of your setup, especially when using 10 foot rods. This is the least expensive of the reels on show and one that comes highly recommended for those that don't want to break the bank. Although compact, these mini big pit style reels need to hold enough line and lay it on their spools in such a way to maximise their versatility and casting potential. A good quality line clip is also essential when fishing accurately at range. The Castism QDA was subjected to an extensive design and development process when it came to its spool. The 25mm stroke spool with a 65mm diameter represents a breakthrough in spool geometry. This unique blend works perfectly to deliver flawless line lay and distance casting whilst bursting a significantly smaller spool than traditional big pit style reel. This is where the name castism comes from and reels fitted with a castism spool have been known to match the power of the bezier, a feat that was previously considered impossible. When you want to hit marks with the use of a line clip, the Castism hip clip will cushion your main line even with big leads at high speeds. The Castism holds 320 metres of 12 pound line, which is plenty for fishing with a variety of line types in the margins or even off into the horizon. Daiwa's Castism BR has exactly the same clip as the Castism QDA that also has a beautiful line lay that will help your main line peel effortlessly off the spool. The Castism BR also has the same line capacity and spool design as the QDA, therefore offers the same angling capabilities. The 55FS from Witchwood sports a unique line-friendly ACS clip, which enables you to clip up just like any other reel. 
but gives the ability for the line to automatically disengage when a fish takes line. Great for those who want to leave their line in the clip without the risk of their precious setup ending in the drink, a feature that none of the more expensive reels on test boast. The deep, long profile spool holds 330 metres of 0.35 line, which is 12 pounds, which gives the angler plenty of rope to fish with, regardless of the venue they're targeting. Shimano's XTD offers superb line lay thanks to Shimano's ability to be able to reduce its slow oscillation technology even further. Shimano's flagship reels such as the Mag and Power Aero have an oscillation rate of 100 coils per turn, whereas the XTD has 50. The slow oscillation theory follows that the slower the line spools up, the more precisely it will lay, and in turn the easier the line will leave the spool on the cast. This is ideal for the distance carp angler as it ensures that you can enjoy flawless distance casting time after time. The superb line lay and long range casting potential is enhanced by its sprung line clip that will buffer hard casts with heavy terminal setups. The profile of the line can also be adjusted via changing the washer arrangements to suit your angling. Whether it be flat, tapered or reverse tapered, the profiles can be set to your angling preference. Housing 290 metres of 12 pound line, the XTD has several line reducers to help tailor to suit your needs and ultimately save you spalling up with unnecessary amounts of line. Although Fox's FX9 is the least expensive in our collection, it prides itself on delivering micro line lay adjustment and super slow oscillation. This is further complemented by not one, but two range casting line clips, one black and one silver. For those who want to angle multiple marks swiftly and effectively, its distance casting profile holds 200 meters of 12 pound line, enough for the vast majority of UK and European angling situations. Sonic's Tornos also delivers surprisingly good line lay, coupled with a strong yet well cushioned line clip for such a low price tag. Its long cast spool lip helps the well laid line peel off the spool, which can then be stopped by its sprung line clip, which is both great for braid and mono. The long cast spool of the Tornos has a capacity of 270 metres of 12 pound line, which is very similar to many others on review. How quickly your reel can retrieve line is essential to its effectiveness when fishing at any range, but especially when cranking rigs from long range marks and playing fish. Line retrieval is measured by how much line is taken in per turn of the handle. A silky smooth operation is also a must and something will make your angling much more pleasurable. The Carcism QDA is a stunning reel that retrieves the line at a rate of 96 centimetres per turn of its stunning black anodized handle shaft and ergonomic knob coupled with DigiGear 2 and a 4.7 to 1 gear ratio and a multiple quality bearings that make it one of the smoothest performers in the range but you do pay for this cutting edge technology and high performance spec. The Castism BR has a much better line retrieval than its brother the QDA with 107 centimeters per turn of its handle and a 5.7 to 1 gear ratio and velvety operation all add to this reel's already impressive performance. These impressive stats make the Casters and BR a top choice for those who want to put less effort and more pleasure into their angling. Witchwood's 55FS has a modest line retrieval rate coupled with a 4.8 to 1 gear ratio for added torque, which is more than sufficient for cranking rigs from afar and is surprisingly swift considering its affordable price tag. As previously mentioned, the XTD is one of our most popular big pit reels due to its spec and price tag. The 5.5 XTD doesn't disappoint when it comes to its ability to retrieve line with 105 centimetres per turn of its sleek handle. This is right up there with some of the more expensive reels and although larger than the Castism, its 5.3 to 1 gear ratio, high retrieval rate and technologically advanced bearing system ensures that you make your angling more effective. Fox's FX9 has a modest 80 centimetres line retrieval rate which isn't the best on test but still feels fairly rapid. When using this offering from Fox alongside the others, the difference in retrieval speed doesn't feel as much as the stats show, but don't be put off. Complemented by five stainless bearings and run roller bearing, the FX9 feels very smooth in hand. Sonic's Tornos 6000 is the smallest on test and has an impressive cranking rate considering its compact size. Although it doesn't boast the best stats, it represents fantastic value for money and delivers a good enough performance to be able to retrieve line quickly, smoothly and with little effort. 
A reels drag system should be one of the most important aspects to be considered when purchasing any reel as its function will determine how effectively and precisely you can adjust your angling tool to cater for the power of a hooked fish. A poor drag will often lead to broken line or hook pulls that are the bane of any specimen hunter's angling. As the name suggests, the Cast System QDA sports Diver's QD system, or quick drag, that allows it to be set into a free spool mode in a fraction of a turn. This can then be quickly adjusted back into battle mode with an equally quick and easy turn of its sleek drag knob. This is a great feature and the best available for those anglers that like to do everything from the front of their reel. The precise drag is ideal for playing large fish at close quarters and has an exacting washer system that allows lighter line to be used without the risk of breakages or dreaded hook pulls. For the angler that likes the cast system but prefers a free spool or BR function, the cast system BR has a rear lever that will engage its micro adjust free spool drag, which is disengaged by a simple turn of the reel's handle or by pressing on the lever. Its main fighting drag system is the same precise and rugged system that is offered on the impressive QDA. Witchwood Solace 55 FS conforms to the conventional free spool drag arrangement, which is similar to the cast system BR and comes with a fully adjustable FS system that allows the user to adjust the tension of the free spool via the rear drag to cater for various angling situations and methods. But when it's disengaged, it reverts back to its precise front drag that has enough power to land some truly monstrous specimens. The XTD features Shimano's instant drag that operates around a multi-disc system which enables the reel to go from free spool to its power setting in just half a turn. A really good choice for those that prefer a bit more tolerance to play with over Daiwa's quick drag system, which some find a bit too fast. Once a fish is hooked, the drag feels powerful but doesn't compromise on the precision that's required when trying to avoid breakages and hook pulls. Fox's FX9 has been designed with their quick clutch system which has the tolerance that's halfway between Daiwa's quick drag and Shimano's instant drag, which really gives the user the best of both worlds. Once its drag is in fighting mode, it feels like it has plenty of power to stop any hard fighting specimen, but forgiving enough to be kind on your tackle. Finally, the Tornos operates on Sonic's rapid drag system, which means you can switch from free spool to full drag in a matter of moments. Ideal for letting your hooked fish run until you get to the rod and bend into your prize to do battle. All the reels on test may seem to have very similar specs and performance, but it's the additional little things that put together make a big difference. So what do the reels have that set them apart from the rest? Daiwa's Cast System QDA is the top spec model on offer. So does it justify its price tag and why is it so good? To start with the QDA's mag sealed, a technology taken from Daiwa Sea Range that was originally developed by NASA for preventing liquids from leaking in any conditions, even in outer space. This prevents grit and water from coming into contact with essential internal parts, which would otherwise affect its performance over time without proper care, attention and servicing. Other Daiwa technologies at work in the QDA include Twist Buster, which allows you to fish with braid or mono with confidence you won't suffer from dreaded line twist. Its stunning looks also make it a tackle tart's dream and looks much like a mini version of the ISO QDA, which has been one of Daiwa's most successful out and out big pit reels used by many of Team Daiwa's leading anglers. A superb blend of gloss black body with gunsmoke silver and chrome with subtle metallic red detailing that so many anglers just seem to love. Uh, unfortunately, the QDA isn't supplied with a spare spool, but they are available separately. The Car Sism BR has the same fantastic spec as the QDA, but with a stunning matte black finish and some gun smoke details that some may prefer over the bling of its brother. This stealthier offering from the Daiwa Stable is a top choice for those who want a reel packed with cutting edge technology, but with the added addition of a BR function that some anglers find more user friendly. Supplied with a spare spool, you're able to change line quickly and easily to suit a range of angling challenges. Great for those that fish different venues. For an entry level reel, the 55 FS looks superb and sports an overall matte black aesthetic coupled with a gloss black component such as its spool, bail arm, handle on FS lever. For those that like a subtle hint of bling, this handsome offering from Witchwood also has some fine gold detailing on its spool. Its functional features deliver a surprising array of quality attributes of such a pocket-friendly specimen angling reel. 11 plus 1 stainless ball bearings make this reel feel silky smooth and an anti-twist line roller will keep your line in prime condition. Whilst its high strength drive gear, power bail, 
and unique folding handle finish off a well thought out angling tool that comes supplied with a spare spool for those that like to change lines in a matter of moments. You can tell Shimano really went back to the drawing board with the XTD. Its eye-catching carpy matte black finish with subtle chrome touches has been a real winner for this reel, making it a massive hit with specimen anglers all over Europe. Supplied with a spare spool, the XTD really excels in this aspect, making it ideal for angling on multiple waters or with various methods. Complemented by Shimano's X-Ship, Aero Wrap 2 and maintenance port so you can drop a few drops of oil into the reel's body to keep it running as smooth as the day you purchased it. A new feature and one that we're sure to see in future Shimano reels is XTD's parallel body. A new design that helps reduce the chance of the line coming into contact with the blank, therefore increasing your casting potential. Fox's FX9 is extremely feature rich and boasts a twist free line roller, a rotor brake and an anti backlash system all based around an aesthetically pleasing black graphite body with gloss and matte tones with subtle silver touches. This compact offering has been extremely popular with those that fish with 10 foot and 12 foot rods alike. The FX9 doesn't come with an extra spare spool but these are available at very affordable prices. For those anglers that are fans of the stealth look, the Tornos 6000 from Sonic has really hit the nail on the head. It's entirely black finish with beautiful matte and gloss contrasting components make it really stand out, looking like a much more expensive reel. The reel's performance is complemented by a titanium coated line roller, CNC machined alley handle and grip and a dual strength stainless steel main shaft. The core of which are all housed in and around a high strength carbon composite rotor and body. Thank you for tuning into this TFTV review. We hope to have given you a comprehensive insight into some of the best big pit reels on the market. Tackle Fanatics stock an extensive range of reels to cover all types of specimen angling. If you need any advice or have any further questions about any of the reels you've seen today, please call our customer service team on 0208 949 3307.